love me. XOXO. Gossip Girl. There are three things we do alone. We are born, we die, and if we're a high school junior headed for college, we take the SATs. And anyone who's used to bending the rules will find themselves breaking them. This evening at my penthouse, you'll find personal tutors, hot stone massages, mani-pedis, and an amazing acupuncturist who specializes in mental acuity. Guess that beats my dad's lasagna. I'll flick over some photos for you. Oh, it's upperclassmen only. I'm sure you understand. Totally. Oh my god, Georgina. You're really gonna hurt my feelings. And you know how I get when my feelings are hurt. <sighs> no, a boyfriend. You know, if I'm gonna make it to Queen, I need a king. Queen Elizabeth. Let's give this to you. Here's my number. <laughs> what are you doing? He's gorgeous. He's a dog walker. Vanessa, you're Nate, right? You play a very small but crucial role in my video project. You know, I've actually already taken it. My parents don't want me going to USC, so I had to make sure my scores were good enough to get in without their help. Which, thanks to these books, they were, so I'm done. While we all love hearing about the struggles of the idle rich, Dan's got a fine tutor right here. changed since we used to hang out, Georgie. I know, I get it. How about this? How about for one night, we hang out like old times, but unlike old times, I won't get out of control. Nelly Yuki has her sights set on Yale, too. What are the odds of them accepting two girls from Constance? And have you seen Nelly Yuki's extracurriculars? You need to be made aware of one little thing. Nelly Yuki. Find Nelly Yuki's weakness and exploit it. So. You want one G or two? Can you just give it? Some dealer, you know? And say that instead of studying with him, you're out with your old pal, Georgina. No, I don't want him to know she exists. My mom. Blair, even you can't stand her. Dan, of all people, cannot know Georgie. As we know. Serena has food poisoning. She's too sick to come to your play date. How are you feeling? Good, my migraine's gone. What? No, my boyfriend broke up with me at a Flo Rida concert. One minute we're weak. Tonight, you're gonna come over to my house and just cry till you get it all out of your system. I can't. But I don't think he's a walker. I think he's the owner. I'm good. And that's why I called you. To apologize. I read one of your practice essays. You left it in a book that you gave Dan. Yeah, listen, let's have dinner. I mean, I, I want to hear about your... Seeing as you've returned to Valentino and you've logged 10 hours of volunteer work, we better get the shop. I'm not grounded anymore. I have something for you. No way. It's not exactly <laughs> the same as the one you pawned, but... You know, Jen, no one's happier than me to say this. Do you know how much it costs to get a zipper repaired? Yeah, I figured since you'd be spending so much time at home. Wait, what? So I guess you're still grounded. Yeah. yeah. Dad, wait. I met this really nice guy and I'm supposed to meet him for lunch tomorrow. Oh, grounded or not grounded, you're not old enough. Hello, Todd. Hi, Nellie. Blair's so do I. Can we talk about it in private? Okay. Seats. <laughs> you don't strike me as a lesbian punk fan. You know, I'm almost offended by how much you underestimate me, Miss Abrams. You like punk. Oh, I didn't hear you, you said punk, because you had me a lesbian. Um... God, this does feel like that doorstep moment. And what moment would that be? So, tell me about Dan. Trouble. Look, I think I can still make it, but please go to Hunter and try to keep the doors open until I get there. I can't. I didn't even study. Rough night? Yeah, and not in a good way. Todd doesn't want to get back together. No, but he said we stayed up all night having the same conversation about why we broke up over and over again. But I also believe in insurance. <laughs> From our calculator. Missing you. Hi, I'm Serena Vanderwoodson. For you. She was with me. No. 
What he means is we were both at home. Um, my stomach started acting up again. Oh, okay, a food poisoning relapse? Look, if, if, if you didn't study enough and you freaked out, I can... I told you I was sick. You paid someone else to take the SAT for you, and that's the best you can do? What are you talking about? I'm talking it wasn't you. Chuck, what did you do? I told you to keep the doors open. When I got there, they were closed. Yeah, they don't keep the doors open. Chuck, you went to... What's Georgina got on you? Chuck. Then I understand, but what's so bad you can't even tell me? If I go down, you go down with me. Stay out of my life. What are you doing here? I was just gonna ask the same thing. Since you couldn't come to the hot dogs, I'm bringing them to you. Oh. Hey, buddy. Oh. There you go. Oh, Georgie. Hey, bad boy. Sorry he disturbed you. Uh, it's fine. I love dogs. Really? Do you have any? No, uh, we used to have a cat, but, you know, sister allergies. Now the cat, Iggy, lives in Florida with my grandma. Uh, doesn't write. Never calls. <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that. It's just a cat. <laughs> um, I'm Sarah, by the way. I'm Dan. Nice to meet you, Sarah.